In April 1815, the world witnessed one of the most catastrophic volcanic eruptions in recorded history, the eruption of Mount Tambora, located in present-day Indonesia. This explosion was so powerful that it altered the global climate and led to what became known as, the year without a summer. The eruption began with a series of smaller explosions on April 5, 1815, sending ash clouds high into the sky. But the true devastation came on April 10, when a massive explosion shattered the mountain. With a volcanic explosivity index of 7, Tamara's blast was more than 100 times stronger than the 1980 eruption of Mount St. Helens. The force of the explosion could be heard over 2,000 kilometers away, and the ash plume reached a height of 43 kilometers, 27 miles, into the stratosphere. The once mighty peak of Mount Tambora was reduced by more than 1,500 meters, 5,000 feet, leaving behind a massive crater. The eruption unleashed torrents of pyroclastic flows, fast-moving clouds of hot gas and volcanic material, that engulfed villages, burning everything in their path. Ashfall buried towns, and acid rain poisoned water supplies. Over 10,000 people were killed instantly, while tens of thousands more perished in the following weeks due to starvation and disease. But Tambora's impact extended far beyond Indonesia. The vast amounts of ash and sulfur dioxide released into the atmosphere spread across the globe, blocking sunlight and disrupting weather patterns. The year 1816 became known as, the year without a summer. Crops failed across Europe, North America, and Asia, leading to severe food shortages. Snow fell in June in parts of the United States, and persistent cold led to widespread famine. The eruption and its aftermath claimed an estimated 71,000 lives, making it the deadliest volcanic disaster in human history. Its effects reshaped societies, triggering migration, economic downturns, and even influencing art and literature. Some historians believe that the eerie skies caused by Tambora's ash inspired artists like J. M. W. Turner and writers like Mary Shelley, whose novel Frankenstein was conceived during the cold, dark summer of 1816. Today, Mount Tambora remains a quiet but ominous reminder of nature's destructive power. Scientists continue to monitor volcanoes worldwide, but the question remains, could such a disaster happen again? The past has shown that the Earth is unpredictable, and history may one day repeat itself.